Hello you guys, it's Katie and welcome back to another video. For today's video, we're going to be seeing how much I can market prep in one week. So, I do have a list written out here that I wanted to read off to you guys for all the items I would like to prep. Now, this is a lot for one week. This is basically just the items I would like to restock. But, I don't think I'm going to get all this done in one week because it is a lot. But those items that I have on my list are two aliens, three axolotls, two bees, five chicken nuggets, one egg, three mushrooms, five frogs, two ducks, three mini bears, two mini octos, two mini whales, four octo keychains, five regular octos, two penguins, three triceratops, four whales, five pickles, and two opossums. And that is a total of 55 items, which like I said, is a lot, especially for only one week. Of prepping so we'll see how many of those 55 items I'm able to get done. Now as always for my videos I will have any crochet patterns, yarns, all materials in general used throughout today's video. Link in the description box below for you in case you're interested in making any of this stuff yourself. And as always for these kind of style videos I am not necessarily like crocheting and only crocheting every single day. This is just how much crocheting I would get done in a typical week. So I am doing other things like editing YouTube videos and like working on other patterns that aren't included in market prep and all that kind of stuff. So the purpose of this video is basically just to see how much I can market prep specifically in one week. But with that, we're just going to get started with the first day of me crocheting and we will see how much I'm able to get done in seven days. All right, you guys, first thing I am making for this video is a light blue axolotl. So this light blue is going to be the body, and then this is going to be the gills. So I'm going to go ahead and get started on that now. Okay, I just finished this little axolotl and it is pretty late, but I do have 20 minutes left in the video I'm currently watching. So I'm gonna crochet until that's over. I don't know if that'll be enough time for me to finish a full project or not. We shall see, but I am going to at least start something else. Okay, I have now started a little octopus that is going to be a keychain octopus so we'll see how far I'm able to get into this Alright, today is day one, and I didn't crochet very long today, but I did manage to get two items done, and as you guys saw, those two items were this little axolotl and this mini octo that will be a keychain. So that is one out of three axolotls done, and one out of four octo keychains done. So that leaves our total now down to 53 items since we started out with 55. So I should have quite a bit more time to get crocheting done tomorrow. So I will update you guys then as I am crocheting. Okay you guys, it's now the next day and I am starting on some triceratops. I am first doing this dark green one I woke up feeling not so great this morning, so I'm hoping that I'm not getting sick. 
we'll see hopefully i'll feel better tomorrow but for now i'm gonna go ahead and work on some triceratops Alrighty, here's the first Triceratops done. I'm now going to make the second one. Okay, so I just finished the second Triceratops and I'm now going to do the third one and that's probably it for the night because it's already 11 o'clock and as you can tell by my yawning, I'm pretty tired. It's a Saturday today so I didn't crochet as much. I was just hanging out with my family and stuff plus not feeling good like I mentioned. But anyways, I'm going to at least do this Triceratops and then be done for the night. Alright, I just finished this light purple Triceratops, so that is all three of my Triceratops that I had written out as my goals done. So I'm going to go ahead and mark those off, and that is day two done, and three items for day two, so that leaves us at... 50 items total left for the rest of the series so I'll be back tomorrow to crochet more as long as I don't end up feeling way worse we'll see but either way I will keep you guys updated all right you guys it's now day three and I'm currently working on a little rainbow bee I have two of those written on my list that I would like to do so I'm hopefully going to do both of them tonight However, it is already 10 o'clock, so we'll see if I can get both of them done by like 11 or so. That'd be great. But anyways, I did do some crocheting earlier today. It was just downstairs while I was hanging out with my parents and stuff, so I didn't bother to film it. So I'll show you those items whenever I do the recap once I'm done crocheting for the night. But for now, it is just a little rainbow bee that I'll be working on. Okay, so I didn't even finish this bee. <laughs> All of a sudden, I just got really tired. And since I'm still not feeling the best, I've decided that I want to go ahead and go to bed. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you the two items that I did manage to finish today. And those are one little octopus. So that is one out of five done for this goal. And then I also did another axolotl so that is two out of three done for that goal 
So that's two items total. And that brings my new total down to 48 items. So this series is going to take me longer than I wanted it to, I do believe, because I'm not feeling the best. But anyways, we'll see how much I'll be able to get done tomorrow, hopefully more. The past three days have been pretty much the weekend anyway, so I've been kind of relaxing. So now that tomorrow's Monday, hopefully I'll pick back up and get a lot more done. So anyways, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow once I am up here crocheting again. Okay, you guys, so another day where I did some crocheting downstairs because I was hanging out with the dogs and everything. And all their toys and everything are down there, so it was just so much easier for me to go down there. And plus, we have a puppy now, so she will try to eat my yarn if she comes up here. <laughs> but anyways, I finished the one bee I was working on yesterday and made a second one. And I also did a regular size octopus and a baby one. So I am now working on another regular size octopus in this color. And then I will be doing a baby one in this color right after. So I will keep you guys updated for once I have finished this and then start the baby one as well. Alrighty, I just finished up this octopus and I'm about to make a second baby one like I mentioned but I'm going to do that off camera because I am going to make a reel and see how long it takes me as you can see by the stopwatch there. So that'll already be posted by the time you're seeing this video but anyways um, this little guy is just going to be off camera for that reason but I will come back and update you once it's done. Okay, I finished making this little guy and now I've got some Chanel Home Slim yarn and I'm going to make a chicken nugget or two. It's already pretty late so I might only make one, we'll see, but I'm going to at least start on one. Okay, so I did just finish this one chicken nugget and I'm now going to go to bed because it is 1.20 a.m. <laughs> so, um, as far as the recap for today, that's one chicken nugget out of five done. And then I did the two rainbow bees that were on my list. So the bees are done. And I did two regular octos, as you guys saw. So that is now three out of five done. And finally, I did two of the baby octos as well. So that is the two out of the two that I wrote on my list done. So today is day four. And that is a total of... Two, four, six, seven items. Yesterday we ended off with 48, so 48 minus 7 is 41 items left for this series. So I will come back tomorrow to continue crocheting more and we'll see how much I'm able to get done tomorrow. Okay, guys, so I didn't have much time to crochet today. 
The only thing I managed to get done was part of this little alien, but I am gonna continue to work on it. And it is a little bit earlier tonight than I have been sitting down to crochet the previous nights. It is 8.03 right now. I think every other night this week I've sat down at like 10 or 11 to crochet. Um, but today I didn't take a nap, so I'm here earlier. And I am going to go ahead and finish off this little guy and then move on to the next thing, which I will keep you updated on, of course. Okay, so I finished this little alien guy. And now with the same green, I'm gonna go ahead and make a leggy frog, which I'm almost out of this green, as you can tell. So I'm just gonna use what I have and then start on this new skein. Okay, so it's actually been like two and a half days since I talked to you guys last. So you saw me finish this alien and I was working on a frog that I have actually yet to finish. So for that day, that was day five and I managed to finish only one item because that was this one alien. And then yesterday, I didn't update you at all, but I did make this one little opossum and that was also the only thing I managed to make throughout the day. So that was one item, so that leaves me down at 39 now. And today I haven't managed to crochet anything towards this list either. And it's currently Thursday. I'm about to go pick up my boyfriend from the airport. He's been gone this whole week. Um, so I'm about to go pick him up. So I'll still be crocheting and stuff at his house. I just won't be recording it. Um, but I will, whenever I get back home, give you guys an update of what I crocheted that is towards this list, but for now, that's all I have to update you on. Alright, so here I am with another update again that I'm just showing you what I made because like I mentioned, I picked up my boyfriend from the airport and I spent a day at his house, so I was able to get five items done while I was at his house and those five items were three chicken nuggets and one little octopus that will be on a keychain, so a keychain octo, and one little bear here. So that now brings my total down to 34 with those five items. So that means in a week I did 21 items, which is definitely not as much as I was hoping, but I still feel like that's a pretty good amount since I was also doing other stuff, not just crocheting, of course. I always have editing and computer work and stuff to do business-wise that is not just crocheting. So I feel like with all things considered, it was still a pretty good turnout for 21 items in seven days. All right, you guys. So for a little recap of what I got done in the past seven days, it was 21 items like I told you guys. So those 21 items were one alien, two axolotls, two bees, four chicken nuggets, one mini bear, two mini octos, two octo keychains, three regular octos, three triceratops, and one opossum was the 21 items that I got done in seven days, which I am pretty happy with that. Like I mentioned to you guys, it wasn't necessarily me only market prepping for one week. I did have other types of work to do that wasn't just me prepping these items so with that being said i am pretty happy with the 21 items even though i did write out 55 items on this list it wasn't necessarily i need to get this all done in a week it was just 
if I'm going to have time, this is the items I would like to get done, basically. Anyways, though, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please do give this video a big thumbs up. And let me know in the comments down below what you thought of today's video. And if you guys want to see more videos like this one. And let me know what your favorite item was that you saw me make in this video. I think my favorite recently has been the chicken nuggets. But the possums are always a favorite of mine too. So I'd love to hear what your favorite was that you saw me make in today's video. And now if you guys do want to see more from me. Of course you can check out more videos of mine. My blog, my Etsy shop, my Rumble shop. All of my social media is my second channel. All of that is always included in the description box of every single video for you guys. As well as for today of course. I will have all of the crochet patterns and materials in general used throughout today's video linked below for you. But with all of that, thank you all so much for watching today's video, and I will see you guys here in the next one. Goodbye!